Good day, dear colleagues, dear moderators. Thank you very much, uh, uh, dear honorable guests. Uh, it's very sincere from me to call you sincere uh, honorable guests. I'm a very... So this is high rating conference, which is devoted to the um, international conference, early childhood care and education. Thank you very much, the organizational committee for such invitation to be the speaker in the plenary session. It's very important for me. So my topic is future in the present. What kind of a teacher of a modern preschool is waiting for? So all the speakers before that were before me uh, told pretty much about the same things. So we look into the same direction. That's very important for our professional community. And uh, my presentation will probably uh, invite you to think or about the new kind of a teacher for modern preschool. Speaking about the kid, we always and also tell uh, the, the kid like a subject, as uh, the subject in the life of the activity or the subject of the uh, of the relations but this is also a subject of the educational relations but the, and this uh, uh, problematic field is con of the preschool education we do not ask uh, kids is the kid satisfied with the quantity quality of the education what is the result of the preschool education for the preschooler the most uh, simple diagnostics that can be used by all the kids in all, all over the world. This is their wish or unwish to go to a kindergarten. This wish or unwish can be connected with different reasons, but the leading one is the uh, is the specialist who meets uh, the kid. If we speak about the modern kid, we have questions. If the person is ready to communicate with the world, uh, can the person be open with the world? Can uh, the person open itself for the world and uh, his opportunities, his or her opportunities? We can make a separate report about the modern uh, uh, kid and what are the interests of the modern kid, but it's not the topic of our today's uh, conference. In the background of such a modern kid, there is a specialist, let's say, who is covered, for example, with different activities, who deals with different activities, and there is professional standard and regulations. Uh, parents uh, are the full-fledged, let's say, subjects as well. They dictate their own conditions. And here we have the question, can and one, uh, does, uh, and does this uh, specialist ready uh, to communicate with this um, kind of subjects, events, and problems? And uh, does uh, the person ready? In, there is a study that I have. In the 2010, we conducted the study about the values uh, of the modern kid, and we asked questions. Why do you like your, your uh, pedagogical person? Can you ask your teacher? And do you like your teacher? We covered 1,500 kids from uh, a lot of different uh, regions in Russia. So our university also made the study so modern childhood, so modern portrait. So our spe students from our university uh, made uh, the pool of kids from 5 to 15 years. Uh, so uh, asking the question, do you want to have the same teacher as you do for your friend? There is no difference between the data of 10 years uh, that we had 10 years ago and this year. You can see some figures on the slide. You can see that the kids of preschoolers were speaking about the uh, 
all the preschoolers. They are very po positive for the teacher. They love this teacher as the preschooler can love. And this is Russian preschool I want to highlight. In our Russian mentality, love, that means sympathy. So uh, sympathy means a love in Russia. For example, teacher uh, has a headache, and uh, when uh, kids have uh, sympathy, and that is uh, belongs to 90% of the asked uh, of the respondent uh, kids. In some regions, just eight years, eight percent can ask the teacher everything they want to ask. So there is a question mark here, and we have the problematic field here for thinking, uh, characterizing the teacher. Speaking about uh, preschoolers, uh, they uh, characterize the personality through uh, the uh, appearance. So she is, for example, beautiful and kind. She is well dressed and uh, joyful, for example, while kids were characterizing her. her their teachers. Eighty percent of kids do characterize in this way. These are their teachers. But half of them tell that uh, the teacher uh, teaches uh, them the discipline and following the rules. There is nothing wrong with it, uh, following the rules. But the expectations uh, from the of the kids from the teacher do not coincide. Uh, what uh, he expects and what the teacher offers. In this slide, there are some f uh, quotes of the kids. And uh, if we generalize all these answers, a large quantity of kids, we can say that about the modern teacher for modern preschool. So modern uh, preschooler is waiting for a modern teacher. From one side, the teacher should understand the kids' the subculture. Maybe we do not like it. They are the heroes of the modern cartoons or books. And uh, understanding teacher can understand the secret world of the childhood and the problems that are in the heads of these kids are very important for them. For us, they are maybe uh, they seem primitive, but for him, they expect uh, their future. They should uh, be equal and loving and feel this equality, but not uh, like uh, the teacher in its uh, full-fledged understanding. The teacher in the preschool uh, kindergarten should not teach, let's say, as kids think, but be equal and love the kids. So uh, the kids are waiting and are open for the uh, personal interaction. They notice the particulars about the behavior their behavior, and of course the kids are waiting uh, for the teacher who will support the initiatives. It's really hard to support the children's initiatives with the group with more than 20 people. It's not possible to support all the initiatives. If we do not, uh, but, uh, if we do not uh, support this initiative in the, of this uh, wish of acting, then we shouldn't uh, wait then to, when they are adolescents, they will be initiative as well. If we speak about the professional activity of uh, the teacher in the preschool uh, centers, kindergartens, there are some more information. There is some more information. So kids are waiting for active person. This person wants to be changed, uh, changes himself, him, herself. He's interested in life. He's not indifferent to what's happening being uh, living in the professional routine, but he's active with the burning eyes. The kids are waiting for uh, understanding and accepting personality, accepting this kid with all the particulars about this kid. And uh, he cannot know who is the Niznaika. This is a Russian character from the book. 
kids' book. So they're waiting for the teacher who, who knows a lot uh, and can teach, but not really teach, but uh, show, let's say, that, so they could learn easily. The professional activity of the teacher of the preschool centers is a very metaphorical issue. How to bring and teach the preschoolers? That means that the teacher knows uh, uh, how to discover, how to understand, to research, to help and assist the kid because I know uh, this. Uh, this kid and uh, understand the, uh, the kid's problems. So how can we tell that a teacher of modern preschool center is the one uh, who needs uh, kids? So, uh, the kids uh, tell us that this is not uh, like this. In, uh, in our uh, Russian reality, we have a question what we should do. So, uh, thinking over this question, I'd like to apply what we have done already. And in the framework of the projects that we have done, uh, all the uh, pedagogical and non-pedagogical high schools in of our uh, country for the last four years, we're speaking about the complex uh, project of modernization of the Pedagogical Education Russian Federation. I'd like to tell a couple of works, words um, what is uh, in, uh, important for me no, and that we not, should not lose in the results. That were the profi profile um, projects in order to change uh, the system of preparation of the future pedag uh, teachers and prepare the a readiness uh, for different standards, educational, prof uh, professional ones. And these profiling projects that uh, last for four years in two stages, and we did this project, 18 universities that participated in this uh, project allowed to do this project one of the best in all the complex uh, project of modernizations and it's uh, really a pleasant thing for us that scientific and educational community that is uh, does not accept uh, teachers of uh, early childhood or just teachers uh, as uh, full-fledged teachers let's say they're not the teachers of biology or chemistry but there is the effect of acceptance of importance and uh, particular issues about the preschool teacher from Kaliningrad to the Baikal area and Zabaikalsky area. For four years, uh, the universities uh, uh, had pilot projects on testing and preparation of the new students of the future teach teachers. So this uh, approach helps to develop new researches, new net uh, programs. Our uh, preschool community is very open. So in such community includes not only uh, kindergartens but universities and we offer everyone who wants to join this organization, uh, this conference. What's the new thing here? The content of the preparation identifies uh, through the typical problems of the preschool teacher, but not uh, the abstract tasks, but practical tasks connected with the operation with a modern kid, with interaction with it. Yeah, uh, tasks that are in the normative uh, uh, documents. So what else uh, new in this project? We have a new situation of interaction with the practice of uh, education. Only 
uh, knowing the real practice of uh, organiza of education, we can prepare very high qualified um, uh, future students that started to uh, work uh, in 2014 in this project, uh, finish their um, bachelor's program. So I have feedbacks from Ufa, Novosibirsk, and other cities, Saint Petersburg. These are different students, and the main difference between them and uh, the uh, graduate from the past, they are not afraid of resolving the tasks in this model. Uh, the practice of the preschool education is the responsibility, and doing the practical results is other main priorities. So practice is uh, the first thing. So this is supervisor, teacher, let's say, who mentors uh, the kids. So this uh, project that is built on the module principle, and the slide that you can see on the slide really reflects the effect of the project. The beginning of the project is module is connected with a, a task, abstract task, to try to, to know how to communicate with a kid. In two, two and a half months, you can see at the photo in the angle of the uh, slide, you, we see the student of the university that uh, have a full-fledged program. They really resolve the tasks of the kids. We have the net of situations for two uh, and a half months, we teach and train students how to deal with the kids. So we do uh, consider the significance of all the tasks. There, is, uh, there can be psychology of communication and uh, practical in kids' questions, pedagogics in the preschoolers, and everything other um, theoretic and practical. Uh, subjects. So this is the main result of this project. Why I'm saying so, so uh, these uh, issues so long uh, to this auditorium? I guess we can uh, use these results in our future. So we should do uh, what, sh what we should do. We have a question then. And uh, this uh, question um, gives us the following uh, thinking. We shouldn't mention again this auditorium that the younger the kid, the higher should be the qualification that works with this kid, who works with this kid. If I'm speaking about the modern preschooler, it's uh, understandable that education of the modern specialist cannot be, let's say, finished. It should not finish ever. So it should be uh, discreet. We need to uh, have constant education for our specialists, lifelong education in this prof prof uh, profession. You can tell me that we have this system, we have the system of higher qualification training courses, we have uh, some other courses, but here I'd like to tell you that uh, about the myth and the reality. I guess that we can speak only about the special system or special model of the constant education of the teacher of the preschool that can be used, uh, that can use the results that I mentioned uh, at the very beginning. And this model of constant lifelong education is oriented to the growing skills and competences of this profession, professional. Of course, uh, this model based on the best traditions of the uh, preschool education. This is the best system, one of the best one, uh, one of the best one uh, bit, uh, among all the systems uh, in the world. I'm very responsible uh, for these words. Well, I'm from. Uh, Childhood Institute of the Harrison State Pedagogical University from the department that uh, was uh, uh, founded in 1925. 
that was the Frabel's uh, courses and classic courses. This, uh, were, uh, the Frabel's courses started in 1872. The best traditions uh, should be the basis of the system, and they are. But in this system, also takes into consideration uh, the particulars of the modern subjects, of the modern system of the preschool education. And the tasks of the professional activity are connected with the incentives of the specialists for the course of education and motivate to resolve different tasks while interacting with modern kids. Only in this case, the system of lifelong education of uh, the teacher of a preschool is through all the net. So this is uh, the entrance uh, to we uh, start uh, with the school, then we continue with the college, then uh, courses, uh, high school, bachelor's, master's, uh, uh, programs, universities, there can be different uh, routes of uh, uh, creating these models of the lifelong education, but they should uh, be and they should appear because, uh, of, uh, because of its importance. We need to consolidate our efforts in our community. We have uh, discussed that we can research the uh, childhood only through interdisciplinary approach. We need to include practice. The tasks for research appears in the real practice of education. The kid uh, are, is in the kindergarten, and here is the problem for the scientific resolution. Education should not be separate from science. So education is, uh, to, goes together with the science. And this is the united system. This is the model which includes the uh, teacher in this full cycle. If the modern teacher is not included into the getting the new knowledge about the kid, we can say that this professional which is ready to work with this kid and only getting the knowledge about the modern kid allows to update the methods and approaches of upbringing and educating the kids. Why uh, do we have the training course and do not give this professional satisfaction to the practitioner teacher? Uh, due to the fact that he is getting familiarized uh, with some methodology and some principles which has nothing to do uh, to the uh, child of today and they do not take into account his peculiarities. And the educational station may be then uh, Dol Masha should uh, uh, just wash the uh, cups and the children, by the way, want uh, sometimes to use the disposable dishes. But the concept of the story is that uh, it is indicated in the textbook that cups should be washed. And uh, uh, therefore, the methodology needs to be changed. It has become more uh, smart and accommodative. And uh, that is a part of the model I've just identified. And so uh, we need to build up uh, some fundamental and professional skills and habits. And, uh, a teacher might not have too many basic groups uh, for the professional activity. Uh, he needs to communicate with the child, support his activity, take care of his education, uh, set up the environment, and organize the educational program in the kindergarten. But you understand that uh, the situation is not as simple as that. That's quite an ironical one uh, sometimes. Uh, and uh, uh, 
I should say that we have some uh, com uh, competences uh, for communicating with a child, and we need uh, to master them. And uh, a child should have a clear understanding whether he wants to communicate or not, and that is a basic motivation. Uh, and uh, a teacher has to be motivated whether he wants and uh, knows how to communicate with the child. And within the framework of his or her education, uh, they uh, have to study how to project this process. And uh, the qualification may become higher uh, for that person if he communicates with his uh, child with special needs, individually, etc. But basic competences have become indispensable. And uh, uh, the pedagogue understands pretty well what needs to be done in that system of lifelong learning and continuous learning. That was uh, what I wanted to share with you today. So if we have uh, such system set up, uh, we may train uh, the up-to-the-mark uh, specialist uh, for uh, the smart children of today. And when you ask a child uh, what needs to be done if you have uh, the uh, magic stick, and if I have this magic stick, I would rather never grow up, uh, be a child all my life. What needs to be done uh, for the children, for uh, them to appreciate their childhood uh, full, on a full-fledged basis?